and welcome to another video by The Peppy Techie. I had a Peppy Techie subscriber ask a question on how to import media from other sources. In LumaFusion, when you're in their timeline, up in the area to the left where you have your photos with the little flower where your sources are, over to the right of that you have three dots. And these three dots say, I've got more inside. And inside is import media. And from here, you can import media. Now the last place that I was, was in my Peppy Techie out on Dropbox. So I can just go back to sources and here's all the sources. So if I was to click on Google Drive, I've not logged in yet. So this program would have to authenticate me. So I do have Dropbox and I will go to images. Then I'll go to little Daisy here. So double clicking doesn't do anything. Once you find what you want, you then click on the door with the arrow and it downloads the media. So it is downloading it to your iPad. It's not putting it, however, in your album. I'll show you where it is putting it. It's going to open up and it's in the imported folder for Dropbox images. So when I click this little folder, here's all my imported items. Here's Dropbox and here's images. That's where I got it from. And then I have diff all these images of Daisy Claire. The important thing to note is the following. These items are on your iPad in this imported folder. You can't just delete them while you're in LumaFusion. So I will show you what you should be aware of. If you go out of LumaFusion and go to your files, if you are not aware of where it is, just type files and this folder right here will show up. You want to click on it. The location is on my iPad. You will have a folder called LumaFusion. This is your user media. Here's my Dropbox right here. Now it says 16 items. That's 16 folders. There's a lot more items in there because I have 18 just in music. If there was something in here that I knew was taking up too much room and I wasn't going to use it again, I could click select highlight it, and then I could come down and move it, delete it, duplicate it, or share it down here on the bottom. That's the answer to that question. I hope I helped my subscriber who had that question. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Hope you'll subscribe to the Peppy Techie channel. Please make sure you hit the bell so you'll be notified when I make a new video. And leave your comments down below. Your questions, your thoughts, even your advice is much appreciated. And don't forget to smash that like button. Thanks for watching the Peppy Techie channel.